Okay, today we're going to learn about how to use the wind tunnel here, this new wind tunnel, the blue one by the TA station. The first thing you need to do is take the big cord attached to the wind tunnel and plug it into the wall. And then the next thing you're going to want to do is take your fog machine and plug that into the wall so that it can heat up if you're doing flow visualization. Once you have the wind tunnel plugged in and you have your fog machine also plugged in if you're using it, the next thing you need to do is you need to take this switch right here and turn it on with the controller inserted. So now looking at the controller, when it starts up, you see this V here and then 4.1. You're going to hit back reset first. Then it'll show an M by itself with a flashing arrow. You're going to hit the up button until it hits R with the flashing arrow. You're going to hit OK. Now you'll see this number and in hertz. This is how you set the velocity of the wind tunnel. You're going to press OK once you see that and you see it flashing. It'll flash once and then it'll flash the numerics that you're going to change. If you don't want to change this decimal place then go to the left one by hitting the left arrow and go to the right by hitting the right arrow. And then to change the number you change it up and down. So if I want to do 55 I just hit the down arrow. If I want to set that you hit OK. Now if you hit OK again you notice that it flashes once and shows that. Now if you hit OK and it flashes once and stops, it means you're done setting it. And if you hit the right button on accident, it's going to go to reverse the motor. So make sure you don't hit that button to the right after you hit OK. Then you're going to hit the green button and it will start up the wind tunnel. So it's going to ramp up to the full speed and wait for about 30 seconds for it to get stabilized. And then when you're done with the wind tunnel to stop it, you hit stop. Now, running and you want to change the speed, you hit the stop button. Then you hit the OK button. When it shows the flashing number, you just change it to the number you want. So say I want 5 hertz. I select it, I hit OK, and then you hit the green button. And it will ramp up to 5 hertz. And then if you want to stop it, you hit the stop button. And then when you're done, you go down, turn off the switch to off, and then unplug the cord. And that's how you start up and stop the wind tunnel.